Well, if I'm completely honest, I'm not much of a shopper. And uh, I knock you up outside them major shopping things. Uh, what I do like, and especially in these times, is supporting, uh, you know, your local businesses, like the farm shop that we went to. Yes, there is one or two people queuing now, but you're in and out within within 10 minutes. And, uh, you know, we're living in some strange times. Now, where I live, this, where I'm standing now, is all supposed to be Greenbelt. Now, on Tuesday night, there was a, a thing on Channel 4. I, do, I don't watch television that much, so I missed it, so I can't really comment on it. But I was in the work the Wednesday, and uh, a few lads got on about it. The truth about Amazon. Now, uh, my missus has that catch-up. So on the Wednesday night, I went home, tried to put it on and catch up on it. Uh, they took it down, they took the, the programme down uh, within 24 hours. I don't know why that is, because everything else that was uh, programmed for Channel 4 that, uh, that Tuesday night was, was shown. Now, why, why I'm mentioning this is that uh, what with all the local businesses and your small businesses mainly going out of, uh, out of business, this year, I always thought this was Greenbelt. Uh, that is going to be one of the biggest Amazon stores, I don't know, in the country or in Europe. It is absolutely massive. All that was fields. Uh, they're working, I think it's six, seven days a week uh, to get it finished. Uh, and I just look at it this way. There's going to be times where you, you, you're not going to want to come out of your house because you can lay in bed, go on your phone, click what you want, and it's delivered to your doorstep. Uh, may, maybe, you know, some people think that's a good thing, avoid all the queues. Uh, some people, you know, mean a bad thing. Uh, you know, everybody's an individual, you've got to you ask yourself a question. In fact, sometimes you've got to ask yourself several questions. But anyway, there it is. Amazon. I don't use Amazon. I have, I'm, you know, I'm not going to lie. I have used Amazon through my son just to order me a few ferro rods uh, now and again. Uh, other than that, I won't know how to buy from Amazon or or anything like that. But uh, the future. Well, that place back there I've just come from, I call, uh, I call it Five Fields, uh, mainly because it's bordering Five Fields. It is so on me, uh, my daily exercise, I'm going to have a, a walk down to Bluebell Wood. I, uh, well, it's well into time from. So uh, it's not far from home, and uh, quite a pleasant walk. Been doing this walk for years. Mind to wear this. That sun is burning me head. So uh, all I've got is a coat in case it gets windy, uh, a can of beer, and a pair. So 
I'll get down there. Well, there's not as many years uh, I can remember, but the years now are a lot of uh, <coughs> wild garlic. So I might take a few of these flowers here and see what I can do with them. Well, I don't think Lado. Lach has been in the field. But well, he's laying us past. And then when we've got to get to that bridge. Well, the flowers in here, and now they don't want us to leave. Hey, hey. I've just come from that bridge there and I'm going to see how much this sunset not a soul about I'm going to have a beer and a pear Well, there is one little bit, bit of uh, positivity, really, about uh, the, this lockdown that we're going through. Uh, for those that venture out, they are having to stop local, and uh, they are they are coming out and seeing the local beauty spots, and uh, I think they're quite surprised how beautiful it is. You know, j just a couple of miles uh, around them, and I mean, I love it down here. I love, uh, I love this place. And circular walks, long walks, short walks, but on days like this, you know, I mean, why, why wouldn't you want to go for a walk in nature and uh, and enjoy, just enjoy the surroundings. Anyway, I better get back and finish this can, and I'm going to see what this sun does here.
कलर Well, I did get a couple of beef burgers and some bacon from a uh, farm shop. Got a few uh, garlic buds. I've got some bacon burgers. Yeah. I ain't got no cobs. I might use that. Well, that is good. I've got another one on here with a few uh, garlic buds, flower buds on. So I'll give that a try. There we have it, the wild garlic bacon burger. Well that bit of wild garlic does uh, add a bit of a taste to it, but that is sound.